Ladies and gentlemen, today I stand before you with a heavy heart, grappling with a harsh reality that placues our beloved Kashmir Valley, the scrooge of drug addiction among our youth. It is a topic that demands our attention not just as a community, but as a parents, guardians and mentors responsible for shaping the future of generation. In our pursuit of providing comfort and security to our children, have we inadvertently robbed them of the most essential ingredient for growth resilience? Have we shielded them from life's harsh realities for so long that they are ill prepared to face them when they inevitably arise? The truth is our parenting practices have played a significant role in fostering an environment where drug addiction flourishes. Instead of instilling a sense of responsible a sense of responsibility and resilience in our youth, we have coddled them in, in a cocoon of comfort, shielding them from the challenges and hardships that are an intrinsic part of life. My dear, from a young age, we have pampered our children, catering to their every whim and desire without teaching them the value of hard work and perseverance. We have created a generation that is ill-equipped to handle failure, rejection and disappointment. The very challenge that built character and resilience, but it's not just about shielding our children's children from adversity. It is also about the unrealistic expectations we place upon them. We pressure them to excel academically, to pursue prestigious career, to measure their worth by societal standards of success. We push them into a right race of achievement without stopping to ask if it's truly what they want for themselves. In our quest to keep up with the chances, we have forgotten the importance of nurturing our children's individual talents and passion. We fail to recognize that success comes in many forms, not just in the form of a high paying job or a fancy title but in the pursuit of one's passion and fulfillment of one's dream. But it is not too late to course correct. We can draw inspiration from countries like Japan and Israel. We are parenting practices focus not just on academic achievements, but on cultivating resilience, independence, my dear, and a sense of purpose in children from a young age. That's very important. In Japan, children are encouraged to embrace failure as a natural part of the learning process, instilling in them a sense of perseverance and resilience. Similarly, in Israel, parents emphasize the importance of exploring one's passions and talents rather than conforming conforming to societal expectations of success. We must adopt a similar approach in our own parenting practices. We must expose our children to the realities of life from a young age, allowing them to experience failure and adversity and teaching them the value of resilience and perseverance. We must encourage them to pursue their passion and talent rather than forcing them into molds that don't fit. We must empower them to chart their own paths in life guided by their own aspiration and dreams. My dear, but most importantly, we must lead by example. We must show our children what it means to face life's challenges with courage and resilience. To pursue our passions with unbearing 
determination and to find fulfillment and meaning in the pursuit of our dreams only then can we hope to break the cycles of drug addiction and practice our value and build a future where our youth are empowered to thrive not just survive thank you me dr rahman mustaq take care i hope you share this video as you can and also you subscribe 